Good morning guys, welcome to today. Today, Gabby's gonna give you an update on Molly's training. First of all, you guys should all know that Ruby has, or Molly has turned into a Dalmatian. She's got spots. Oh, she has a big spot right there. All over her belly. And she's sucking my thumb right now. Uh, also, when she was wet, she had spots the other day you could see that she has spots all up and like she must have spots all underneath here. Oh, also she has she's a, a spot black there. Spot there, yeah. So we would know our dog if somebody stole their dog. We just have to under, wet her, right there. and we'd know it was her. Okay, stop fighting your sister. Stop, stop. Yeah, Ruby, you tell her. All right, here we go. Come on, Molly, sit. Mm -hmm. oh, <laughs> Put the camera on, and she doesn't do it. Sit. No. Sit. <laughs> Okay, five seconds ago, Sit. Gabby just went through all the things and she did them perfectly. Sit. No. Sit. Go Good girl. girl. Sit. 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 She's too excited. Sit. Good girl. Oh. Don't go. Sit. She's doing them in order. She sit, lay, speak. Yeah. Sit. Good girl. Give her a treat when she sits. She's just like. <laughs> Did you get to the castle? No. Sit. Where are you at? Molly, sit. Okay. Good girl. Oh, Molly, speak. No. Then <laughs> I taught her that. All right, let's try it again. We fixed her. Okay. We fixed her. All right, Gabby. Show her what. We, show us what she can sit. do. Molly. Sit. Okay. Molly. Molly. Okay, every time I turn on the camera, she's broken. Um, sit. Molly, sit. Okay. She's she's, she's done. Broken. She's toast. Alright, you guys, she's she's overtired now. She's she's too confused. But we could so in the past, what Gabby does is she tells her three <laughs> commands. Sit, lay, speak, and once she does them, Gabby gives her the treat. So, so what you saw, so what you saw was Sit. Molly doing all three of them. Sit. She's got them memorized. Gabby just stands in front of her with a treat and says the things, and she sits, drops, and then speaks. So she Molly. knows them. Gabby needs to work on separating them now, Sit. which she was doing really good after Maybe I turned the camera down. off. But the minute that I turned the camera back on, she yeah, lay she's down. done. So you guys know that the mall here is open and that we're in stage two of COVID and um, we need a lot of stuff. Like we've been holding off shopping because we haven't been able to go shopping and then when everything first opened last week, I didn't want to go and be in like a big, huge jungle of people. So this week we're gonna start getting all the things that we need. We're gonna start getting back into shopping. Um, we have a lot of things we need. So today is Thursday and we're gonna do some of our shopping today, one part. Like we have all different, like we need shopping for us, shopping for our homeschool, we need shopping for our horses, we need so much shopping. We need shopping for summer shopping, like we need so much shopping. So we're gonna start it today. That minute that you go shopping with your kids and you tell your kid to change before you leave and then you get shopping and you look. <laughs> Okay, so Gabby's so good. We are waiting in line. Sophie's playing a game. Gabby's reading. All right, so we are here for Gabby to get some new books. Gabby, these are them, young adult fiction. All right, you get a book too. So we are at a secondhand store. Apparently we were standing in line for like a half an hour because it wasn't open yet. Basically, Gabby needs books. She like has been reading like the last couple of days straight. Good for The you. lost queen. Gabby. Yeah, Gabby is the lost queen. So we're here to get some books. Knocking one thing off our list. This is good. I read the first one. I read Catching the Fire. Yeah. yeah, you have that. This is good though. Oh, no, that's a sad. cute diary. See if anybody wrote in it. Because sometimes at secondhand stores, there's writing in it. it closed. Even after all these years, I still don't like vlogging in public. People stare at me. Oh, it's for holding your phone. Or maybe even a camera. Let's see if it works for the camera. Oh my gosh, that would work for the camera. Okay, so I read The Fallen series by Lauren Kate. This is a new book called Teardrop. It looks really good. Read the cover. Read the cover. What cover? Mom. You open it inside of the cover. 
Mom, I think it's a good deal. Buy four books, get one free. All right, let's buy four books and get one free. All right, so Gabby can't find any books that she likes, so we're gonna have to go to chapters. But they are enthralled with Matt Globes. So while I'm shopping, Gabby is bored. Sophie's bored too. She's looking through my Snapchat. How many have friends? Friends all the way down. I have friends to upon Z. friends. Yeah, all the way down to Z. I have friends. Look, 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 we're still going. We're still going. We're still going. Yeah, and so she's sad that she does not have that many friends. So what tell them what is your Snapchat so they can my, come follow you so you can have friends. Mine is either Sophie or Finn or Finn and Sophie. Sophie and Finn or I Finn think and Sophie? Finn and Sophie. Here. What's yours? Right. I'll tell Sophia's first. When you're cooler, that moment when you find out you're cooler than your kid. Uh, no, that's only because you opened your snap to fans. Mine is Storm and Gabby 66. You didn't open yours to fans? No. Well, then how are I you never gonna... showed mine. Well, how are you going to... Oh, I see what you're saying. You never advertised? All right, so it's on now. You guys know that everything wait, in our family is a competition. So how... Let's see if it's Finn and Sophie. Finn, Finn and Sophie. With two All right, so well, she only has a snap score of 267. I hardly snap. All right, Gabby's a snapping queen. So if you guys want to follow her, go follow her on Snapchat. I'm not a snapping queen. Let's Kaylee see. has like a hundred thousand. Well, let's I only have see. Five thousand nine hundred. So well, let's see. Let's see what happens. Okay. Right now she's changing my profile picture on Snapchat. This is the new me your eyebrows oh no, this one expresses yeah you. that's me that expresses me uh, eyebrow color gray <laughs> black brown there we go no <laughs> do not do that all right so we spent all that time an hour almost an hour 40 minutes in that store and all we bought was a bikini top for gabby a doggy puzzle a horsey puzzle. And Sophie bought baby stuff. Baby stuff for her babies. Oh my god. I know. I tried Can we throw that stuff out? Yes. I tried so hard to keep her from buying that stuff. I was like, no, no, no. And she's like, but Gabby got a bathing suit. I'm like, yeah, I'll buy you whatever clothes you want. She does not want to clothes though. She only wants toys still. Soon, Sam. Soon we'll be missing the toy stage. Soon we'll be two old people in our own house with our own time to do whatever we want and we'll be bored and we'll be missing that we had kids. I won't be bored. I know I won't be bored either. <laughs> I'll have the best gardens. I'll have the best horses that are so loved and groomed every day. It'll just be amazing. Also got this amazing international standard shipped package from somebody in Europe. I bet it's a picture. Oh, this is it. So this picture has is made up of all of the word Stella. Like Stella is written, if you guys can see really. See? Isn't that beautiful? Oh, how creative and beautiful. Also, this beautiful picture, fly high. Although we may not see you, doesn't mean you're gone forever. You taught Sophie, Laura, Gabby lots for that. Rest easy, girl. I'm sure she will be eating many carrots and treats. Finally, lots of treats for Stella. So that beautiful picture was sent by Emily. Thanks, Emily, so much for your beautiful picture and your beautiful picture painting. And your beautiful picture of Stella, so super adorable. Such a good idea. Oh, and she sent those too? Oh, so super cool. So you could put this on a necklace. Adorable, you are so super creative, Emily. Okay, so we are headed home now because even though that store was a bust and they had nothing there for us, uh, we have to go home and take our boys off the grass. Yeah, that's what we gotta do. That's what happens when you have horses. Like, you seriously be standing in the store and suddenly have a panic attack that Storm broke free because I dreamed a couple of days ago that Storm broke free and it's driving me crazy. It was so hot in town. I was like, oh my gosh, the horses are gonna die. We better get home. You have a sticker on you. I have stickers all over me. And then when we got yeah, home. You had a flower thingy on your butt. Like the thing that they <laughs> Went did. shopping in the store and Sam screamed out the Why window. Gotta hear what There's something on your butt. Saying. I don't. 
Gabby got me hooked on Snapchat now. Yeah, you okay, do. Okay, so this is what I got. So it all came. Oh, you didn't open my snap. Inside this bathtub. You didn't open my snap. I, I got will. this little Disney thing. And inside I put this. This is stuff all for my baby dolls. I got this, which I'm gonna give Brooklyn. Because it's too small for me. Um I got a hairbrush for my baby. Oh Chloe! I got a super cute hat. So he's um, gonna make a good mama one day. Some shorts. Fun fact, I was the same as her when I was young. This thing and some clothes. That's and cute. Clothes. And then this bag. Well done. Good shot. I would have much preferred that she got clothes, but you know, who cares as long as she's got dolls. Toys. Every day that's not a heat wave, I have been, we have been trying to fix up more things on this farm. Unfortunately, it seems like most of that is cutting grass. Like, all we do is cut grass. But when it is a heat wave, all we do is swim. <laughs> that's all I can do. Hi, ponies. This way I'm going to bring you in. Horses are out there, hot as heck. They know, they know when it's time to come in and it is time to come in. It is so much cooler in here. What is it? It is 25 degrees in the barn, 25. No sun, so it's so nice. All right, let's see if we can do this the right way. See if we can do it the right way. Pick a stall, pick your own stall. One at a time. Wait, Gracie, let Willow go first, and then I'll guide her. Go, girl. Ah, this way. This, ah, 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 Willow. Okay, I'll guide you. <laughs> Come on, over here. You're sharing the, the barn. The, I know, I don't like to pull them by there. Don't open the door, are you crazy? Don't. <laughs> Okay, in your cell. That's a girl. <laughs> Everybody's scared of Gabby. Also, we are down to our last one, two, three, four, five, six, seven bales of hay. Uh, our guy called us though last night and told us that he has more hay, so we'll be picking that up. Look at that cute little statue in the field. Why is she waiting? Who's she waiting for? The little statue in the field. Aw, she's so kind. Basically, we have to genie proof the arena. If you saw yesterday's video, then you may have seen that he likes to play with, things. play with things, touch things, make messes with things, ruin things. He killed our shark. Killed our shark. You know what I want to do? I want to open the back and let all the horses out there. You know what I'm saying? So they can eat the rest of that grass. And then the minis can have that space all the time because they're slow eating it. I've been looking up everything that happened to Chino. So he got bruises on his feet, which is our problem. He has bruises on his feet. Uh, the tops of his feet were, feet were burning hot. And I don't know if that was from the bruises or if it was from the grass. So, so bruises can cause an abscess and so can grass cause an abscess. So either his feet got so long they were along the while we were waiting for the farrier that he got bruises and then an abscess okay so these are my two options either okay vote below either storm no either chino's feet got too long while we were waiting for the farrier and that caused him to get bruises which in turn caused him to get a small abscess in one foot so that's option one or option two, because of the increase in grass, we just increased them to four hours a day, he was starting to go into like a founder flare and that caused the abscess. But yeah, now that I say it out loud, it feels like it could be number one. Like it was all caused by his feet getting too long. So you guys tell us in the comments below, either the grass had an effect on his feet, our vet is coming on Tuesday, I'll be chatting with him and or number one, because if he can go back on grass, I want him to go back on grass. I'm scared though to try it, especially when we're still waiting for the bruises. Bruises take a long time to heal. 
Yeah. All right, we are going to the pool, but before look, Chino's like, look, they all were like out there peeking at us yesterday. Yeah. Okay, so Sophie's wearing this t-shirt today, and I know you guys can't see it. I made this two years before I got pregnant with Gabby, like two years before I got Mommy's pregnant. So this is 16 years old. Mommy's okay, so my niece and my nephew came over, and we got fabric markers, and we decided to decorate shirts. And this is the shirt that I decorated. It had my name with a heart, and then I did a cloud and a sun, and in this sun, it said Gabriella Elizabeth. And in this cloud, it said Sophia Alexandra. I know you can't see it. You have to believe me, but it does say it. You can kind of see the Gabriella Elizabeth. Three years before Gabby was born, three years, two years before I got pregnant, I made a shirt that said Sophia Alexandra and Gabriella Elizabeth. And I put it on my shirt and that shirt was like so close to me. I wore it to bed all the time. It was like a big, huge piece of my heart because I wanted to have two little girls and then look what happened you guys like look what happened three years after I made that shirt I got Gabby and then another two and a half years later. I got Sophie I'm not little. But you were I'm big. Okay, totally opposite point of my story But you're only barely a teenager <laughs> But yeah, so you guys anything can happen and don't Dare to dream, dare to write down all your dreams and make a storyboard and, and, and imagine. Dream it, believe it, achieve it. Why? Dream it, believe it, achieve it. Write down your dreams, think about your dreams, dream about your dreams, like daydream. Go out there when life is boring and you have nothing going on and think about the future and think about all the fun things that you want and imagine them and I promise you guys, dreams come true. That is all I wanted to show you because Sophie put this shirt on for a bathing suit cover up today and it was so close to my heart and it made me realize like, wow, I have everything on this shirt. I should have I should have put more on there. Money! Why, why the heck wouldn't I put money on there? Rich! So Gabby said, what's better than money is always having the exact amount of money yeah. in your pocket that like, you need. Better than winning a lot. Oh. Yeah, that is kind of better. Are they grooming? Watch out. Finn always, Finn always comes over and grooms him. Finn is the one. Finn has to go like this. I know, Finn's over there with his neck stretched right up there, but he always comes over and it's like, cause they've been apart all morning and Finn always comes over and it's like, you want to be friends? And then Tina's like, yeah, okay. And then he gets tired of him and bites him. Or he puts his head on him and Finn's like, no thanks. Or bites These are our friendliest horses. And then that's our evilest horse. No, Even though I still love him and Finn he's wonderful. Finn tries to kick people. Finn tries to kick people? Yeah. Uh oh, back up. Finn's like, hey, you want to be friends? Okay, I'll kick you. He's not a very nice friend. <laughs> Having lazy pool days makes me forget that it's only Thursday. You're welcome. I have something in my eye. What do you say, Sophie? Thank you. So I spent all that time building that little thing to hang our towels, and then I realized I could have just used this. With them, but at least 76 degrees. 76, degrees. 76, is, 76 degrees is better then really hot because then you at least get cooled down. Like it's better for it to be cold. Well, cool. I like it hotter too. I like it hotter too. I have this whole tub full of pool toys. This one was from the beach. Might be ready to throw that one out, but that's a fun one. And I have, I have a rubber dinghy, which is fun. And I also have a laying down mat. Every time we bring Molly down, Gabby dunks her in the pool so she gets wet and it, and she hates it because she needs to learn water on the ground. But she's black and she gets so hot down here. So now she's sulking in the shade and poor Ruby, you too. Should we dunk you, Ruby? Should we dunk you? The weirdest thing happened, the craziest thing. Something you guys might not know about Gabby is that she had a fever when she was two and then another time when she was six, she had the flu. That's it. That's the only time she's ever been sick. It's the only time she's ever been hurt. The only time she's ever, like she never has anything bad has ever, ever happened to her until today. Today, after she went swimming, she was sitting down and she got a really bad pain in her side. I thought maybe she had appendicitis, but it's not that. And she, it hurt so bad that it was hurting in her, in, down into her leg. She couldn't even move. So I had to sit down there by the pool with her while she took Tylenol and wait for the pain to go away before we could come up to the house for supper. 
And the crazy thing is that Gabby has never taken Tylenol in her entire life. Like, ever. I don't think she's ever taken any medication, ever. And she ever. said it was gross. In her entire life. Like, it was the weirdest feeling ever. Imagine never being sick for 13 years. I have my baby here. Meet the new baby. She's not new. She's got her new outfit on. She's I got beautiful. Her new stuff. I love that color I'm on her. I'm changing her into these things for swimming. I don't know where the bathing suit went. She's going swimming? Yeah. And that is why Tylenol works so good on Gabby. She's all better now, completely better. When you don't take Tylenol for a lot of years, it affects you very fast. So this is what we've been doing each day when it's been like this heat wave. We have been locking the horses in during the hottest hours just in the afternoon and then letting them out in the night. I'll hold her, she's in the room. Anyways, Sam beat us down to the barn and what he found was Finn playing with the hula hoops. Like these guys are so funny. outside or stay in the arena but when it's this hot I swear the horses always stay in the arena I'm so glad to have it all right little miss pony out you go uh. so this is the hula hoop that I am assuming Chino destroyed because Chino, Chino how do you know it was storm who said Oh, Storm, I guess, wrecked this one. And I have a little video of Finn playing with this one. So funny. I'm going to play it for you guys now. He's my baby boy. day in the pool anyway that is it for today's video I know it's kind of low-key when there's a heat wave not much can happen the whole world kind of shuts down in a heat wave See you guys tomorrow